Alright, hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm Wild Sparrow, and this is episode. I don't know which one it is. <laughs> of Going Under Season 3. Now, I'm gonna be honest with you, by the time I'm recording this, I haven't uploaded the other uh, episodes yet. And at, at one point, I considered canceling the series, replacing it, and all around not doing um, TW for a while. But. You know, I started watching Luke and Mild and how much fun they were having, so I want to have fun too. So let's do this. You can thank Luke and Mild for basically, without knowing it, m motivating me to to keep doing the these uh, TW videos. Even though Mild actually tried directly to motivate me because I talked to him about it the other day. Uh, so there you go, a little behind the scenes look. Let's go over the end of the year. Uh, award. So, company of the year goes to All Japan Women's Pro Wrestling. Did they have like good, uh, good matches here? Let me, let me check. History, history. There you go. Oh, 76, 75. Oh yeah, these are, these are actually the best tag team league. Manami Toyota. How come the best tag team league has one tag team match? Manami, to Manami Toyota was a great wrestler, honestly. I say was because I'm not sure if she's retired or not. I don't think so. Um, so yeah. Um, match of the year goes to Kensuke, Sas Kensuke Sasaki and Gen Gen Genichiro Tenryu. I hope I didn't fuck that up. Uh, Mike Awesome and Mr. Ganosuke uh, won Team of the Year. A show of the year went to NJPW Ancient Honor. Let me let me see that show. Ancient Honor. Oh yeah, 90 rating with a 98. All right, makes sense. Makes sense. All right, I can see that. Young Wrestler of the Year Masato Tanaka. Brian Maxine is Veteran Wrestler of the Year. Aja Kong wins Female Wrestler of the Year. Makes sense. Uh, Akio Sato wins uh, Manager of the Year. Um, Jay Taro wins announcer of the year. Lioness Asuka wins comment color commentator of the year. Was she retired by then? She was retired by then already? At 34? Alright. And referee of the year goes to Marty Asami. Now, here's a report for our show, which was amazing, by the way. Greatest show of all time. Starcade 1997 was awful. A real bomb. So I really want to know what happens with the, those lawsuits. As you can see, I didn't notice it, but there you go. Wrongful termination lawsuit against WCW by Alex Wright, Eric Bischoff, and Lenny Poffo, which might increase into a class, uh, a class act, but into a um, uh, well, you know what I mean, into one of those things. So yeah, uh, Monday week one, and since I'm so curious about what's going to happen with those lawsuits. I'm not going to run any shows until those lawsuits have been settled. Well, except for, you know, pay-per-views and, and stuff like that. I'm not going to run any TV shows, though. TV shows are off-bounds. Also, I'm just now realizing that I forgot to check the audio before I started recording, so I'm either going to be really loud or really low volume. Which is great. I love it. Steve Logan. Steve Logan is a former World of Sports star. Alright. Scott Steiner loses legal action. Yay, they failed. A WCW win lawsuit against Rick Steiner as well. Successfully sued by Hulk Hogan. Damn, we have to pay two million. Uh, Buff Bagwell will be leaving. Alright. And Sting left WCW, so we're we're actually being successful here. Um, we lost two million dollars. Actually, lost twenty million dollars. Why did we lose twenty million dollars? Why did we spend so much on the workers? Oh, because we fired a lot of people. All right, that makes sense. Um. He's ha handing in his notice, so maybe if I do this, it doesn't make much of a difference, but I still pay 7,000. Who are my champions? 
Mang, Mang, Mang the Barbarian, nobody, and nobody yet. All right. Um, still got, not gonna run any TV shows. Uh, don't feel like it. Um, oh, but we have to crown a new champion. I'm gonna have to do that in the next uh, Nitro. It's gonna be the entire Nitro is just gonna be one match if I can. <laughs> to be one match for the vacant WCW World Television 24-7 Rule Championship. Aja Kong. I don't have a, a women's division, otherwise I'd sign her up and uh, make her champion of everything. Ray Robinson is much appreciated by, by knowing fans, but Jesus Christ, you never let me read! That's really rude. Fine, 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 fine. Uh, when's the next pay-per-view, though? Sold out on Sunday, week 3 of January. So we might just sim all the way up. To oh, no, we got a crown new champion. All right. Locker room incidents. Paul Orndorff. Uh, selfish behavior. Fire. He improved. Simmering tension. See, but I helped him in the long term. Selfish behavior. Fire. For no absolute reason. Alright, at match, filter, can run for 90 minutes. Uh, it's going to be a 10 man. Um, 10 man. Tux that's a 15 man. Tuxi 10 man tuxedo battle royale. Don't know why. Oh, I only have these wor workers. <laughs> really that's sad that's really sad I'm just waiting for death uh, we're gonna take out Chris Jericho and put in Meng uh, make it a 90 minute match for the vacant world television title yes uh, and I need to book 23 more minutes so I'm gonna filter by angles that can run for 30 uh, we're gonna have um, we're gonna have um, um, we're gonna have Chris Jericho with Let's see, who's not over that I can use? Who's not over? Alright, so Enhancement Talents, Openers, and Lower Midcutters. So the Dead Wolf, uh, Lenny Lane, and Lodi hold a funeral for Sick Boy, uh, Sick Boy's uh, career uh, that is uh, administered by Evan Karajias. Oh no, 30. 30. Alright. There you go. That's the best show ever. And we're gonna run it in Japan. Have I been in the Tokyo Dome? Damn it, I have. Alright. See, I was gonna run Iberia, but they don't have Portugal, so. <laughs> so it's not really Iberia. Fix your shit. Uh, 4,000. See, 4,000. Four thousand. Oh, I've been here. Have I been everywhere in Europe? I've been somewhere in Europe. Uh, I've been somewhere in England or in the United Kingdom. Where was it? That was, was it Scotland. Yeah, it was in Scotland. I wasn't in England at all. Not even close. Um, I haven't been to Mexico though. Have not been to Mexico. So we're gonna filter. Try to get the biggest arenas. No. 22, this one it is, alright. Um, and I need to fix this because we all know that Meng is going to win this match. Um, so yeah, that's the match. Uh, let's run the show. In an abysmal match, Meng won a tuxedo in 1913. He won a tuxedo. He won a tuxedo 
Battle Royale. The other members of the final four were Jim Duggan, Disco Inferno, and Barry Horowitz, with Jim Duggan winning the final elimination, getting the most eliminations over the course of the match. Meng wins the WCW World Television 24-7 Rule Championship. Evan Karaji is in the ring along with the Dead Wolf, Lenny Lane, and Lodi. The ring has been set up to resemble a funeral home with a casket with a picture of Sick Boy on it in the center. Karagias proceeds to give a eulogy declaring that the career of Sick Boy is well and truly dead. Hooray! Best show ever! Everybody loves this show, right? I love it. You love it. Oh, Bill Goldberg won the NWA World a Heavyweight Championship uh, on OVW, which is pretty neat. Beating Dan Severn? Really? Bill Goldberg? Gil Bo- B- what? Bill Goldberg? I just completely butchered his name. Bill Goldberg beat Dan Severn. Let that sink in. In front of 119 people, no less. That's ridiculous. Oh no, they're unhappy. Oh no. Oh no. Hard drug user. Take no fucking action, cause he's Barry F. and Horowitz. Don't give a fuck. Oh, I fired Barry Saturn? Oh yeah, cause he's too good. Um, uh, how come I have so little, so little workers? Alright. I'm going to end this episode right here. Next episode, I'm going to cancel all my TV shows all the way up to Sold Out. Uh, sold Out, is it? Is it Sold Out? I think it is. Is it? That's not the championship, the, the, the screen that I want. Uh, is it Sold Out? Yeah, Sold Out, January. So I'm going to uh, cancel all my TV shows up to it. And then when we come back, next episode, we are going to be on Sold Out. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.